Police say a deadly car crash in Jackson may be tied to a car dealership heist. 16 WABC's Tammy Eswick found out the crashed car was taken right off a Louisiana car lot. Police say a deadly crash on Bailey Avenue could be tied to a car heist in Louisiana. Now, cops say the gray convertible was just one of two stolen out of a Baton Rouge dealership. We know that one of the Camaros was involved in a fatality over the weekend. Just like that dealership in Baton Rouge, this dealership has hundreds of cars on their lot. Now, the manager says he didn't realize those vehicles were gone until someone called him and said they saw that story on 16 WAPT. Jackson police say witnesses told them 24 year old Ernest Adams crashed into this power pole after losing control of his brand new convertible Chevy Camaro. His mother says he was headed home after getting something to eat. Brian Harris Chevrolet dealership says that's when they found the cars were gone. All that was left was this hole in a nearby fence. The other Camaro that was stolen is not local. We don't know where it is. JPD tells 16 WAPT that they have confirmed the VIN number was from the dealership's car. Family members of the crash victim say Ernest Adams bought the brand new convertible for $800, but they say he did not steal it. He was loving, caring, everybody loved him, everybody in the neighborhood loved him. Tonight, police are still searching for that second missing red convertible Camaro and looking into who may have pulled them off of the lot. In Jackson, Tammy Eswick, 16 WAPT News.